Alright, what's up guys? So, I'm gonna be going into a little bit more things uh, here. I just killed two spiders and one of them dropped that. That little spider eye. Kinda looks like a um, like a heart. Tiny little spider heart. And uh, we're gonna be using that a little bit later on. Um, I need to try to get back up to my place. Which is, I think, on that mountain right there. And it's going to be a bitch. But, uh, I don't know how I have 127 wheat. But I think that's the reason. I think maybe my wheat glitched or something. I don't know, or maybe it was my item editor thing. But, uh, I think that chicken was trying to make love to that spider. I'm sorry that I killed your, your friend. Uh, well, not really that sorry. That's a neat little cave. I gotta get back up to the top though. Do, 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 do. Alright, so we're back. Um, I don't still have any bones. Uh, there is a few more changes that uh, some stuff I like, some stuff I don't, uh, such as glass panes. Apparently now, don't give you back glass. So when you break it, that's that's it. Which kind of sucks now because I don't know. That was that was a huge thing for glass panels, you know. Everybody loved glass plant panels because you get them back, you know. It, it wasn't, you know, um, it wasn't shitty like the other glass was, where it's just, as soon as you break it, that was it. You're done, you know. And uh, I really don't like the way glass looks in the default texture pack. It's way too bright, you know, and it's it's kind of hard to see through. I don't know. But uh, actually, um, he over here, I wanted to show you that to make um, glass bottles, it's just like that. A little boat with glass, and um, that's how you make glass bottles. Uh, again, not sure exact use for them yet. I mean, I, I know they're going to be used for potions, but I don't know how to make potions. So for right now, this is, uh, this is what they're doing. Um... Hello, chicken. See, so you have brought me an egg. Come, come, come back up here. Oh, another chicken down there. There you go. Come on up. You're no good to me down there. Alright, there you go. Have a bottle. No? Alright. He doesn't drink. Um, I was gonna say, can I not pick that up? Alright, so what else did I want to show you guys in this video? Um, apparently uh, the old pumpkin fellas... I'm going to turn this down, it was a little loud on my headphones. Still a little loud. Okay, so the old pumpkin fellas, if you provide them with wheat, they get all pissy and attack everything. From what I heard... But that doesn't seem to be the case. Maybe it's because there's no pumpkin to make love to him? He's oh, okay. He's he's going on. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to make a few. There you go. Oh, he went straight into the lava. Oh, well shit. Yeah, he's not happy with me right now. They, um... I don't know what it is, why, why, what the reasoning is behind that, of why you would want to make them attack each other, you know, well, it doesn't hurt though, there you 
guys go. Maybe that's how they make love. They're just like, snowball fight! Mm, that's it. Well, apparently it hurts them. When snowballs are thrown at them, apparently it hurts them. And this guy's just pissed at this one. Oh, you're gonna, you're gonna drive him right off the cliff. Oh no! Oh, and, and they're both gone. Yep. That just happened. So there's a creeper over here. And I've been told that these fellas like to attack mobs and that doesn't seem to be the case so I'm going to run now oh well that's unfortunate <laughs> look at oh he's he's found a creeper to throw at too wow I just might keep these guys here oh no don't don't, don't jump off no that's that's a trap well it was good while it lasted say that much. So, in preparation, there we go. Go! Go! Why are you attacking me? Oh, it's because I'm holding weed. Sorry. I'm sorry. It's more pressing matters to go right now than to, to worry about them what I'm holding. <laughs> Man, they're just having a blast right now. There we go. I got him to attack the zombie. Oh no, the zombie won! <laughs> This is kind of funny. Good job, guys. Good job. I'm just going to collect your fallen brethren here and shape them. Can you make snowballs into a... No, you can't. Look at that. See? So what is it? How many snowballs is that? Two, four, six, eight? Yeah. You have enough to make two, uh, two more blocks if they drop eight. Oh, that's just stupid. You get free experience for that? That doesn't seem fair at all. Listen, okay, you gotta go. That's right. I did it. Uh, has anybody tested the texture pack yet for the snow golems? If these, uh, these pumpkins are relative to what their heads are made out of? Because I would like to know. I'm gonna make a bunch of them right now. Oh, I'm gonna make that many right now. Yep, they love wheat. Yay! Alright, so, enough fucking around. I'm going to end this episode because I didn't really do anything. I told you about the bottles and crap like that. Uh, you know, I'm not going to end it. I'm going to go look up, see if there's anything else new, and I'm going to just append it to this video. So, I'm just going to cut to that right now. What's up, guys? My name is Potato, and this is more 1.9 pre-release 2 footage. Um, as you can see here, I have two pumpkins that did grow. Um... I guess they won't, uh, yeah, the ground is still not tilled. I wonder if they're going to fix that or not. I don't think they will, but yay, more pumpkin seeds. Uh, I don't really know what they use pumpkins for aside from just maybe making a unlimited uh, snow golem army because I, uh, if you just keep having pumpkins roll out every time you kill one of these guys, um, well that guy only gave me one snowball, but the, re the other guy that I just killed gave me 14 snowballs. 14! Uh, how do you... I don't even understand how... Whatever, it doesn't even matter. Uh, so, 
as you can see here, I have a few stacks of Ender Pearls. And I've been messing around with these. And by messing around, I mean, well, basically, well, let's try this. Just jump off here. Throw one of those. Oh. Okay, so I threw it too high. But you know what? That's a cool idea. I'm going to try that again. Um, I don't know why I keep jumping off that cliff. It's very easy for me to just to go back up though with these ender pearls. Beat this dirt up with my my shoes, my diamond shoes. All right, collect all my junk and my spider eyeballs. Um, real quick, I wanted to touch on the fact that. Um, I read a little bit more about potions and stuff. Apparently there is cauldrons in the game. Uh, however, we can't make them legitimately, I guess, right now. And by legitimate, I just mean, like, in-game, you can't just craft some. Um, so if anybody knows how to hack them in, uh, let me know. Uh, send, send me something on Facebook. Uh, I'm going to be able to get to that a lot quicker than anything on YouTube. Um... I'd be very, very interested in showing, you know, trying to make potions and, and put out a few videos of that, of combinations and stuff, because apparently there's like over 9,000 different types of combinations, and yes, over 9,000. Figured it was appropriate. Um, but these ender pearls are awesome, and it the only thing that sucks about them is that. You you take a little, well, the fact that, besides the fact that I missed that, um, that cliff edge right there, you do take damage every time you, um you use them and I think it's two and a half hearts uh, or something like that we get some regeneration going uh, I think it's I think it's two and a half uh, I guess our best course of act or course up there is to probably to go up over here and um, but yeah ender pearls they just they fire like arrows and um, that's that's basically it right there you're seeing it oh I may have overshot that oh awesome and uh, it's pretty awesome. It's a very quick way of getting around, and I don't mind getting hurt every time t to do that because I'm just going to regenerate it anyways. So again, uh, if anybody knows how to uh, get the cauldrons in, I tried through MC Edit, but I don't know the ID, the item ID of it. Um, if someone knows the item ID, try uh, try uh, hacking one in through through uh, MC Edit. You know, like just select something and. And putting in the ID and see if um, see if it crashes or not. Uh, if so, or if it does crash, well, I don't I don't want to know about it then. <laughs> uh, we're gonna go into the Nether though because I'm gonna try to collect more of the Nether crap, the new stuff. All right, so I found a stronghold in the Nether using uh, MC Edit and made myself a few sweet looking paths into here to try to find some uh, blazes because uh, I need some of their items there's one right there I will come around to you sir and we'll see how difficult these things are to kill uh, in survival mode oh, oh okay well I'm on fire Probably not a good indication. I have no torches on me because I died. So we're just going to wait here and wait for another one. Okay, there's two. Well, they're fairly easy to kill, um, which is sort of a letdown. Figured they'd be a little bit tougher. Um, and why there is there no brick stair thingies here? Nether brick stairs. There's uh, brick stairs everywhere else, but not here. Interesting. Uh, blaze rods can be made into blaze powder now. And I believe uh, the magma fellas uh, actually have some new items as well. Um, so we're going to go check out them too pretty soon. Hopefully we could find some. Uh, I didn't have any problems when I first made this place. There was some magmas like right outside the nether gate. And um, 
might be a little bit harder now because I know they're supposed to be kind of difficult to find. Really? I'm not. You guys aren't going to drop any more blaze rods, huh? That's it? Hmm. I wonder if people will be able to take advantage of uh, the way he generates his builds and stuff because I know a lot of people they have like millionaire they had randomly generated um, villages but they weren't randomly it was it was more like the placement was random but the actual villages were predetermined these however these uh, these pathways and hallways and crap they're they're not they're not predefined you know they're these are randomly generated and I wonder if um, any mods or modders out there or developers or whatever you guys want to call yourselves uh, can actually take advantage of that and um, maybe we can have even more awesome uh, villages and stuff mm. looks to be pretty barren out here which is a little disappointing because I was kind of hoping to have a little bit more footage of this to show you guys. Uh, another thing is, if you guys haven't already noticed, uh, lava actually flows a lot faster now. And I'll see if I can't demonstrate that here. horribly faster but it is a little bit faster still kind of slow but just be aware of that uh, let's go this way take this staircase up to nothing hello nope how no one wants to talk to me hello anyone home I hear them moaning and groaning, but shit, can't find any of them. Are these supposed to be like little rooms? I don't get it. Oh, I'm hungry. That's why I cannot sprint. There we go. I could use my ender pearls, but I'm gonna use those on my way back. There we go. Hello. So let's see if I can't. Nah, he's moving. But see, when um, when he fires at you, whenever this guy actually wants to get around to doing that. Hi, buddy. Right before it hits, double tap, uh, you know, or if you have it set up to, I think, I don't know if you can switch it from double tap or not. But um, I found that the double tap and then you hit it, it, it works a lot better. It's hard to hit these guys, especially at this extreme angle that I'm in right now. And he keeps going behind the mountains. And I scored a critical on the cannonball. Uh, I'm not sure if that would cause more damage to him. Like, if does it stay a critical on the way to him? That'd be something uh, cool to test out, but, you know, these guys... See, this guy's a, a pansy. I need to get up higher. So I'm going to use one of these. Get my butt on up here. And uh, see if he still wants to play. What's that? Oh, whoa. Alright, fuck that one up. Round two. Ah. There we go. See? It's pretty pretty easy if you can get out into an open area like this so he doesn't keep going behind walls and stuff it's it's pretty easy to kill him now um, again not sure if that's been uh, discovered or not there's a magma guy right there uh, I'll take less damage doing that well waste a golden apple here to get two more health or two more hearts rather hey buddy how you doing no that's it okay well, hmm. 
not a bigger there's a gas tier right there which is pretty sweet I don't think they yeah, I don't think they do anything yet I think this is all just part of potions now and again if you guys can figure out how to get cauldrons let me know I'm gonna end this episode here because obviously I'm not getting a whole lot of footage that I wanted uh, guess my luck has run dry right now but I will oh, I missed that one I will talk to you guys later have fun playing uh, Minecraft for now and I was able to jump up on that that's weird wonder why that you can climb over fences interesting that'll be something I have to look into to see if there's like a half step or something if it's uh, surrounded by two blocks but that will be for another episode and I will talk to you guys later